Hello and welcome to the Shekhar M1 GEO and G8 OCV. This is our 472 kHz Whisper transmitter, transmitting at the moment on Whisper. Um, the input power here is uh, 30 volts at about 3 amps, so it's about 90 watts there. The, uh, the output power here into the 50 ohm uh, load is 189.6 volt. 189.6 volt there, and a nice clean sine wave. Okay, uh, if we can look at the uh, go the other way, you can look at for our transformer with the output. And the second harmonic is well, well down here. And actually, some of the other stations on Whisper I'm hearing are higher than, uh, than, the, than the second harmonic, which is this one. We're not doing too bad at all there. Um, get rid of that, go back to the sine wave. Okay, about 189 volt there, so if we 189.6 volt gives us okay 89.8 it's a little bit optimistic the numbers are bouncing around a bit so let's go for 188.8 is the other figure it bounces to 88.8 okay gives us uh, 81 doesn't, shouldn't, 89 watts, there we go. Okay, the end of the transmit cycle. Okay, so about 30 volts in, maybe a bit over. Go okay, for 30 volts. And we're getting uh, about 89 watts out. So about 98% efficient. I don't quite believe, believe that. Local repeater, sorry about that. But uh, certainly well, uh, well within 90% efficiency um, uh, uh, there for the, uh, for the transmitter, which I uh, can't complain about at all. And then hopefully we should have, uh, for the last, uh, last round, 2230 would be. So there's a few spots uh, here uh, on the last, the next line down as well, on the last transmission. So yeah, not, not too badly, best DX there, G4 VXE. There's been, uh, been some others as well, but that's the uh, the best DX of the last transmission. Okay, so what is it running? Um, the core of the uh, the beacon is an Arduino um, at mega device in the background there. Uh, up here with the flashing LEDs. There's a Jupiter GPS board and a, and a homebrew um, uh, phase lock loop um, 10 megahertz reference. Uh, kind of driving a DDS60 here. The output of which comes out from the back here, around and into the front of the PA. Um, PA here itself is an IRF640 uh, here, and some low-pass filter elements. A bit of uh, transmit changeover, uh, transmit and receive. Receive preamp uh, here, uh, just behind the coil there. Um, then the output comes out from here into a second set of low-pass filters, which was where we were taking the scope. Output also goes into a, a bird through line. Not too accurate with regard to the power because of the 2 to 30 meg insert, but uh, when you look at the SWR, it's pretty much a perfect match uh, into the inverted L. So, yeah, a couple of people just asked me what, what we were running, so uh, a quick rundown uh, from our messy shack. Best 7.3 from M1 GEO.